Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to be cleaning and tidying my home before we go on a trip up to the mountains for the fall. I wanted to make sure everything was nice and clean for when we got home, and that way we can just come home to a nice, clean, refreshed house. I'm going to start in the bathrooms just by scrubbing down the sinks and countertops with a sponge and some Clorox solution. This is just going to brighten and whiten the surfaces and get rid of any stains or soap scum remaining. Once I finish scrubbing down the sink with the sponge, I'm going to dry everything off with a dry cleaning rag, and then I'm going to move on to cleaning the mirrors. I actually began cleaning before I started filming. I already cleaned the guest bathroom shower, so I did that with some bleach solution, a sponge, and some Dawn power wash, and then I'm also going to be cleaning the sink in a similar way. I'm just going to use some of the Dawn power wash to scrub down the sink because the guest bathroom sink is a little bit more dirty than this one. I'm also going to be cleaning the mirrors with some glass cleaner and just making sure everything is nice and tidy. So I'm going to play some relaxing music for you guys as you sit back, relax, and watch me clean or use this video as motivation to get your own cleaning or tasks done. I hope everyone is doing well, staying on top of their goals, and enjoying this fall season. I'm so excited to be sharing some more fall content coming up soon, but until then, please enjoy this nice relaxing speed cleaning motivation. For this next bathroom sink, I'm just going to start off by removing all of the soap and skincare products, and then I'm using this bucket to kind of rinse off the sink before I spray on some Dawn Power Wash in the apple scent. I'm just going to let that soak in and kind of cut all of the soap scum and grease stains, and then I'm just going to give it a scrub with this sponge that has been worn down. And then I'm going to use the bucket again to rinse everything off and then dry everything off with a clean rag. This is our guest bathroom sink and it was a little bit more dirty because we have been using the sink for a little bit. We had someone staying in our master bedroom, but they are no longer here, so we are going to be moving back to the other bathroom soon. Off camera, I also cleaned the toilets, both the inside and outside. I changed out the bathroom trash bags and I restocked the toilet paper. Next, I'm just going to move on to continuing some of this laundry that I started earlier. I'm just going to be transferring a load of wet laundry into the dryer and I'm going to begin folding some towels and clothes. I just thought this would be so much better to get this chore done before we leave for the trip. That way we don't have to come home to a pile of laundry to do and we also have some clean clothes and underwear for our trip. I like to sprinkle in a little bit of baking soda as a deodorizer and then I just use a free and clear laundry detergent.
once the laundry is all folded and put away, I'm just going to move on to tidying up my kitchen. As you can see, it's not too messy, but I wanted to kind of deep clean the countertops and make sure everything was done before we left. I'm just starting off by preparing some cold brew coffee. I just add some cold water to the pitcher and mix in two scoops of ground coffee, and I let that sit for about 12 to 24 hours to steep into the water. I'm then going to remove all of the glass jars, the smoothie maker, and all of the items on the counter just so I have an open space to work with. I'm going to wipe everything off with a paper towel just to get all the crumbs off and any moisture and then I'm going to spray on the Dawn Power Wash and let it sit for a few minutes to really work in the product. I'm then going to scrub the countertop with my sponge which has been worn out a little bit so it's not super harsh on the countertop material but it's just enough to loosen up anything that's stuck on. I'm going to scrub the counter in a circular motion and I'm also going to scrub the walls of the kitchen. Once everything is scrubbed I'm just going to use a wet cleaning rag to wipe off some of the soap and then just repeat that process until the counter is clean and then I'm going to use a dry rag to dry everything off. Now that my countertop is clean, it's time to move on to doing the dishes. I do some of the dishes by hand and then some of them I also put in the dishwasher. It's usually the bigger items or the irregular shaped items that I like to do by hand. So I'm just scrubbing them with some of this Ajax lemon scented soap and then letting them dry on this disc drying cloth that I have laid out. I'm then going to be loading up my dishwasher with some of the plates and cups. I like to use the Cascade dishwasher soap and a rinse solution as well. Finally, I'm just going to clean up the sink surface by wiping it down with a cleaning rag and making sure the rest of the kitchen countertops are wiped down and clean. So that is going to be the end of this fall pre-travel cleaning vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed this satisfying speed cleaning and motivation. I hope you guys are getting all of your tasks done and if you guys like cleaning style videos, be sure to subscribe. I post cleaning videos pretty frequently on my channel as well as other vlog style videos. So I hope everyone is doing well and I will see you soon in the next video. Take care!